So we've looked at how to find the equations of lines given specific information. Now we're going to apply that to finding the equations of lines that are parallel to given lines with specific given information. In this case, we're given the equation of a, of a line that's parallel and a point that our parallel line passes through. We're asked to find an equation of a line parallel to the line y equals 3x plus 1 that contains the point 4, 2. And then we're asked to write the equation in slope-intercept form. So first off, as usual, let's find our slope. So we're given y equals 3x plus 1. That means our slope is m equals 3. So that means that the slope of our parallel line is also going to be 3 because parallel lines have the same slope. Now we're given a point. Anytime we're given a point, that's uh, an indicator that we're probably going to use point slope form. So let's go ahead and identify our point. We have x1, y1 equals 4, 2. So we know the slope is 3. We know a point is 4, 2. So now we simply put that into point slope form. y minus y1 equals our slope m times x minus x1. So let's substitute in what we found. y minus y1 is 2 equals our slope is 3 times x minus x1 is the x value of our given point, which is 4. Distribute the 3, we get y minus 2 equals 3x minus 12. Add 2 to both sides. And we have y equals 3x minus 10. So we know, if we want to verify this, we know that the slope is 3. So that's correct in our equation. And just to double check that we didn't make any mistakes, you can always substitute back in. Does 2, the y value of our given point, equal 3 times the x value is 4 minus 10. Does 2 equal 12 minus 10? And we do get 2 equals 2, which verifies we found the correct equation for a line that is parallel to y equals 3x plus 1 and contains the point 4, 2. And that equation is y equals 3x minus 10.